What's up, Pete? It's your girl, Queen L. Eats. Whoop, whoop, whoop. This is Tweezy Flex. And today, y'all, Tweezy Flex cooked. That's right. I wanted some grilled food and Tweezy cooked on the grill. Um, what we got, Tweezy? Uh, we got some chicken wings, got some uh, skinless chicken thighs, some beef hot dogs, some turkey hot dogs somewhere in there. Sweet potato, got chili for the hot dog, vegetarian baked beans. She got her salad right here. Got my salad right here. The only difference is I got fat free cheese. I got regular. Yeah. Let's say our prayer and get it in. Heavenly Father, bless over this food. Let it be nourishment to our bodies. Bless over the hands that prepared it. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. How y'all doing? How y'all feeling? What? I, messed up. No. I, had brain, I ain't done this in a minute. Y'all know I ain't done more brain in a minute. Okay, well, let me say it again. One more time. All right. How y'all doing? How y'all feeling? What's going on, everybody? <laughs> we hope <up> good. <laughs> All right, y'all, it's time to eat. Tweezy. Brain freeze. <laughs> brain freeze. Brain freeze. Stop. Wait a minute. <laughs> we going to leave that in there, too. Yeah, what's up, y'all? Here, I got a piece of chicken. That's right. There got a piece of barbecue chicken. All right. I'm gonna find my thighs. You got some chicken thighs up in there? Mm -hmm. I got to make me a hot, hot dog. Put this right here. Yeah, them kids told us food up. They were hungry. Here you go. All right, let me go ahead and make me a hot dog. Tweezy cook chili and everything, y'all. He hooked it up. Okay. Put me some of this on there. Put me some of this on there. All right. Got me a little chili for my hot dog. All right. I forgot to get out the um, condiments. condiments for the hot dog. So, okay. We got the hot dog. And... I'm ready to eat my salad. So I just use these same tones for the salad. I guess y'all like, I'm ready for y'all to eat. You need ketchup or no? Ketchup I mean, and mustard. mustard. Yep, and some sweet relish. If we got some, I think we got some. Anyway, love them ketchup. So that, that got my plate so far. Put that right there. Get me some of these sweet potatoes. Some of these sweet potatoes we got here. He got some um thousand island dressing. I'm and he got the ranch right here for me, but I might need to try that thousand island. I ain't had it in a while. It's a fat tree. I guess y'all like Queen Air, you still got that same ketchup you be saying mm -hmm. loud. I don't know why. I think the problem is we keep putting it back in the refrigerator and I'm thinking we got ketchup. We, got ketchup. we really don't. We really don't. And then every time I have to, oh, no. oh, uh oh, he gave me some from, some from Chick-fil-A. Yeah, I know the little pack from Chick-fil-A. It's good to have these condiments, but sometimes you can collect too many and you like, uh-uh, this is too many. So, let me get this sweet relish. Turkey. All right, y'all, let me. There you go. There you go, some of this plate. All right, I already said my press, so it's time to get me. Oh, I ain't getting no baked beans. I ain't getting no beans. Put me some beans on this plate. That one's a lot of reddish. It's all good. Mm hmm. Need some baked beans on your plate? I guess one. Okay. Alright. Now them baked beans is good. Now I don't like slaw, but I do like slaw on hot dogs. Mm-hmm. Yeah, slaw on hot dogs is the best. This chicken is so good. You did that. Got barbecue sauce everywhere, but that's all right. <laughs> yeah. Groceries is so high to where 
I know y'all been saying we haven't been cooking a lot of home food, home cooked meals, because it's about the same as if you eat out now. And that's for real. It's, it's kind of equal and not to be the same. For some meals. You used to save a lot of money by cooking. Mm-hmm. But now, it's almost even because by the time you put on the stove, you know, buy the food, all the stuff you need to cook it, you could have just went and got something for everybody. Yeah. And saved electricity. <laughs> But sometimes you do get tired of eating out. You get tired of getting treated bad. You get tired, tired of I'm sorry because your service was so bad. <laughs> so you decide to cook. Is it a good one, Travis? Mm-hmm. It's not that good. I'm need a nap. Hold on, y'all. I'm gonna get a nap. Scoop it up. Oh yeah, try this thousand dollars. I'm just trying to try something different. No, try it. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know if you're gonna like it. I, you ain't I, got no choice now. I did put a lot on that old dinner, y'all. Golly, I like regular thousand dollars. I hope the fat free good. <laughs> this fat free, I hope it's good. There it is. I put too much, but it's good. The <laughs> crouton is good, you put in it. Sunny day outside. Mm hmm. Brutal. Why well, I say that? Brutal. <laughs> Beautiful. I said, Brutal. Kids went to the park, they got tired quick. They're ready to go. It only take a little bit. That's it. My grandma said she went to Walmart. She said, you know it's around the first of the month. So, everybody getting them EBTs and stuff. So, it was packed. Register was packed. People had them buddies loaded down. You know, people who getting paid on the first of the month, you know, every the first of the month, everything they hit. So, she down. She said, it's a lady. Um, in front, it was a lady in front of her, and then it was a guy in front of her. And then in front of the guy, it was a older lady in one of those, you know, power chairs. So she was in the power chair and she was older and she was with her granddaughter. She said her granddaughter was around like 19. So the lady done rung up all her stuff. The lady was sitting in the power chair waiting on her toe. The lady said $93. She said, $93? <laughs> she said, that lady said, what did, what did I get for $93? She said her granddaughter looked so embarrassed. <laughs> and then she said then the lady kept trying to slide the EBT card couldn't think of the pin number she said that was about 10 minutes right there she said the the um, white dude that was in front of him just walked out of line she said the other, the other lady that was in front of her was like this she said the cashier was laughing because the lady kept saying golly 
And then so after that, when the card finally worked, she owed twenty three dollars. She said twenty three. She said she said it so loud, everybody in the store was looking. She said the granddaughter said, "Grandma, you got soap, you got dust, you got that." I still don't see what twenty three dollars is. She said they went on and on and on. She said the lady finally paid twenty three dollars. Her granddaughter that done dipped. <laughs> She said the lady was like in the wheelchair. I asked the cashier, what she win? She the lady said, your granddaughter took the uh, buggy and walked on out the store. Well, she didn't have to leave me. She, she said, did. <laughs> she said, <laughs> my grandma said, finally, the whole transaction was over with. The lady that was in front of her had done left. So did her. Said the cashier was just falling out laughing. Said the lady finally got out the power wheel and stood up with a cane. Said she was taking little bitty baby steps with some tight leggings on. <laughs> Said that woman had on some tight leggings, y'all. Taking little bitty baby steps. And then she, she kept looking around and said, Dog, she could have waited on me. And then the, then the uh, cashier heard her keep saying shit. She probably brought the car up to the front so that you can just get in the car. She said it took that lady forever to get to that dog. That's why the granddaughter left. She already knew. Already knew. <laughs> and had the groceries in the trunk. Mm-hmm. And chilling by the time you come out here. By the time she, she can just sit there and wait on you to come out. She said, she said, it had frustrated that granddaughter so bad when she kept yelling out how much it cost. <laughs> she said, because she knew what she was picking up when she was picking it up. That was hilarious. <laughs> you gotta count it out. You gotta count it out. My grandma had me hollering on the phone laughing. Because <laughs> at first y'all feeling bad, I was like, oh. Then when she said she was yelling out, $23. <laughs> I immediately thought about myself. <laughs> Who be doing that? Yes, she do. <laughs> I wasn't going to say it. <laughs> I thought about myself and I fell out laughing. My grandma said, first she said, $93. Use the card then, $23. Quinette would literally forget everything she picked up. I'd be forgetting. I'd be like, God, dog, what was $120? I get looking through the buggy. I'd be like, how much was that, Tweez? How much was that? How much was that? He'd be like, dude. <laughs> you were just picking up stuff and throwing it in the buggy. Throwing in the buggy. <laughs> yes, $123 or $126 or however much. I be like, I don't see no hundred and something dollars in this buggy of anything. And he'd be like, that granddaughter, you got soap, you got tissue, you got paper towel, you got that, um, Army hammer, Army hammer Oxy to wash the clothes. We got toothpaste. Taxes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What's the truth? You got Febreze? I mean, he be, what more do you want? You picked all this stuff up. You picked the girls up a shirt. You got AJ a pair of shorts. And she do the same thing when we go out to eat. <laughs> they better come back. I'm like, what do we get? <laughs> <laughs> That's why he don't even let me see the bill. They, they be trying to hand it to me. He be like. <laughs> then one woman. Remember I had got offended when that waitress came and she said, y'all splitting the bill? <laughs> I said, do I look like I'm his sister? <laughs> what she, she would say, yeah. 
What you did? I said, you a darn lie. Me and Tweety do not look anything alike. <laughs> I mean, you just want to be smart. <laughs> Ooh, excuse me. I mean, you just want to be smart. Ooh. I'm good now. Yeah, mm -mm -mm. I was driving today and I seen this guy. He he's it's a, it is it's a abandoned store, but he always parked. And pull a whole bunch of stuff out of his truck and sell it in a country area. Well, there was another guy parked on the other side of him, not next to him, but a little bit over, like he was trying to give him room, you know. He was an older dude, older white man. I said his name around about high eighties, right? He had a big old pot. Get a big old pot. Hold on one second. And I knew it was, that's not me passing gas in there, y'all. That's these leather seats. Mm -hmm. He had a big old pot, but y'all, everybody know what a pot of peanuts looked like. He was trying to sell peanuts. How old beat up truck, it looked like it was gonna fall apart. So I looked and I seen, I was at like a stop sign, but it was somebody in front of me. Mm -hmm. I looked across the street and I seen people going over to the other guy who had a bunch of stuff to sell. And this particular guy didn't have nothing but the back of his truck, the pe the thing for peanuts, and that's it. Nothing. He just just sitting there, just hoping somebody stop. And I, I just kept looking and I kept looking at, you know, both of them. I seen how he kept looking back and seeing how the other dude kept getting traffic coming to him. What was the other dude selling? It looked like just like random household stuff. Might be like little pictures, mm -hmm. but it looked old timey. Yeah, y'all know how stuff be looking like at an old yard sale. You like that stuff look old timey. But people were stopping, you know, and looking. And so he kept looking at, I guess hoping that they'll see him and come over. So I said, you know what? I don't want no peanuts. <laughs> but I'm gonna go over there anyway. And so I went over there. I said, hey, how you doing? He said, fine. I said, you selling peanuts? He said, yeah, I sure am. He was so happy. He was missing just about all his teeth except for the two front. I sure am. I said, okay. I said, how much is your peanuts? Okay, $6 for a bag, two bags. So I think he said $11 to kind of give you a deal or something. I said, okay, I'll take a bag. He had a bag already sitting there. He said, here. I go bag right here. I, I, I just took it out, trying to explain to me that he just took it out, that I ain't been sitting there. Mm -hmm. I said, okay, I'm going to take that bag. So I took the bag of um, boiled peanuts, and um, I had them a $10 bill. He said, hold on. I said, I don't need any change. You keep the change. That's your tip. He said, no, no let, let me get you your change. I said, that's your tip. I wanted some peanuts, and guess what? You have them. And so I said, thank you. He said, thank you so much. And then so, as I was leaving, I kind of looked back and I seen him look at that $10 bill and he shook his head. But made me put it in his pocket. And so, it was something in me that told me to stop and do that. Usually, I'll be thinking about it. Not that, because I don't want none of that old antique stuff. But that particular person, something made me stop to do that, okay? So, I did. I feel good about it. I've been eating on them peanuts. <laughs> <laughs> Tweezers been eating on them peanuts. So, yeah. Well, the peanuts good. Mm-hmm. The king said it tastes like beans. <laughs> <laughs> I can see that. Well, it would taste like beans. <laughs> to a kid. You know, we be tearing up beans, so it don't matter. 
I can eat beans all day long. Beans and cornbread. Whew. I'm done. Thank you for this wonderful meal. Everything tastes amazing. Except for them um, sweet potatoes. <laughs> the boss is good. The sweet potatoes are all right, but they ain't. They ain't right. I wouldn't tell you to buy them again. I got another container. <laughs> Why? <laughs> well, you can take them to work. They're yeah. Good on the box. All right, y'all. This food was amazing. Thank you for the food. All right, y'all. If you would, would you like, share, and subscribe? Hit that notification bell to be notified when we upload our newest videos. Peace out.